and uh, I think I'm having issues with regards to um, I'm taking care of my neighbor's cat and maybe I'm allergic a little bit um, I'm breathing that stuff in the, the hair or it could be she's got a leak in the ceiling and uh, I told her about it today I thought it was from a previous you know and, and they repaired it but it looks like it's uh, hasn't been repaired and it's like a slow leak and I'm afraid it's gonna black molds gonna develop when this rain does eventually end um, but she's in a hospital they're not releasing her because of this coronavirus thing that's pretty scary I was supposed to work Sunday but they uh, they canceled the production for Sunday and next week I'm supposed to work but I got a feeling they're gonna cancel that so I had a fitting today and now I'm testing a new mic that I got today I'm gonna let you guys guess what it is so that's why I'm talking that's why I'm shooting this but I'm heading off to the bank get some supplies because I don't know I got a feeling we're gonna be locked up for a while so um, stay safe everybody wash your hands and uh, hopefully it's not as bad as it's becoming it's just seems like it's all around and it's affecting the economy in a, in a not so good way um, central casting they, they shut down so if they shut down, they, that's major television right there with regards to NBC, ABC, CBS. Um, what other channels do you got? Fox. Um, uh, all of them are probably down, or most of them are following suit. So I don't know. I really don't know. And uh, hopefully there won't be too many people out. So... Stay safe, everybody. Stay safe. Wash your hands. Again. All right. Over and out. Yeah. That was a big bump. Now oh, this guy's got a low car. He doesn't want to take that uh, bump too fast, so he slows down. But you know what? I'm a little higher, so I don't have to slow down that much. There we go. Hopefully the sound is pretty good. Like I said, I'm just experimenting. I'm trying to find out how to import it effectively. So this is all, all new to me. And uh, here shall we go, making a right. Can't always be right. Making another right. And shall we say, uh, it's beautiful light out there actually. It's really nice photography light right at this point. It's getting to that beautiful like cloud cover. Uh, you know, you don't get much days like this in California. It's, you know, I, I kind of love the rainy days. Although the leaks in the condo that I'm living at, they're not fun. So it looks like another leak. I mean, I hope we get this roof repaired soon. Uh, what a mess. What a mess. But that's another chapter. That's another story. Um, like I said, I'm testing this mic to see how effective it is for these one-on-one -on -one kind of vlogging. I know I'm going to have a hard time syncing it, and it's going to, you know, probably slow down my uh, my time. But if I can get used to this workflow and you know keep doing it, I should get better at matching it. And I'll do another clap. So hopefully it won't veer off out of sync. So um, yeah, I don't know if I should drive. I'm gonna drive. Oh, I made a kind of a mistake. I could have, you know, I'm gonna take another street and uh, go another route. It's a little more traffic, but so I don't know what groceries and and what shopping to do. It doesn't seem that busy. Look, look, a lot of people are inside. It's gonna be surprising to see how many people are shopping. Um, that's the problem is like, when you quarantine yourself, like how the heck do you not, you know, go out and get things? 
you're, you're putting yourself at a risk because if anybody's infected because of the incubation period, it, uh, eh, it's like Russian roulette, I think. So I don't know what these places shutting down. I don't know if that can be effective because people do got to shop for things. They can't shut everything down. They can't shut off, you know, like, how are people going to eat? So it's very strange, very, very strange. Um, you know, maybe we wear gloves now and we take precautions. I just don't know. I just don't know. Wow. Here we go. Here we go. Brand new world. I should say brand new, but different. For sure it's different. is good. Walk and talk or drive and talk. These are uh, my driving vlogs. Maybe I should get a, like a little action pro camera. I don't know. I thought I could do it with this, but that <laughs> I hate to be a, but that shake really bothers me when I see it. And I probably borrow, bothers, a, you know, a lot of you people watching. So you know, I guess I could put my, uh, maybe on the way back, I'll do the, because um, I do have it, I do have the, um, my little uh, Osmo Pocket. That seems to be the best for vlogging. I, I'd say that that might be the solution. I don't know how it's going to be at night, because it's going to be at night. So I'll do a vlog, and I'll test the mic, hopefully I'll have enough power to, uh, to see how it is at nighttime because let's see it's 646 daylight savings time just went up uh, an hour so it's really 546 it was starting to get dark about six so it, I would say another 15 20 minutes by the time I'm done shopping everything should be uh, fine and dandy all right pulling in right now now I'm recording so now I got the dual mics with this camera, that camera, and I could do maybe a little vlogging here. Um, on Roscoe Boulevard, it's kind of hot. I'm kind of out of it right at this point. It's been kind of stressful these last couple of, uh, I'd say last week or two with this coronavirus thing. And, uh, you know, at first I thought, oh, it's all hype, you know, it's going to die out. And it doesn't look like it's dying out. It looks like it's killing people and people are dying. And it's starting to take a really turn for the worst. They shut down productions. Um, I'm sure they're shutting down other... I, I mean, where I work, I work in the film industry here in California. And so they're shutting those down. And uh, if they're doing that here then they're going to be shutting other things down too. Like, uh, you know, who knows? Well, mail will be not delivered. Uh, imagine if you can't get any food. Um, this is kind of like a Armageddon scenario, but the, the enemy isn't a nuclear bomb. It's not, uh, you know, uh, an alien invading... I mean, it's kind of an alien where you got a virus, but um, it's just kind of, huh, maybe this is how it's meant to be. I mean, we've had a rule of this planet for, in our narcissistic probably way, thinking we were the kings, we are the best, and, uh, you know, karma's a bitch. Anyways, the cat is cool. He's teaching me a lot. I never knew I could learn so much, you know, about a damn cat that could, you know, help me in just kind of reevaluating my existence. I uh, never had to really take care of, you know, 
an animal that's a house cat like this before. Um, I, for this long of a period, maybe one, two weeks, but now it's been like two months. So I'm hoping she gets out. I'm hoping she gets out. Uh, I forgot there was a camera there. So there's a camera there, there's a camera there, and uh, I'm not looking at the camera. So here we go. I've been shooting a lot. I've been doing a lot of street photography. And so that's an interesting thing. It's kind of, uh, but now I'm going to be isolated, I think. So, I mean, there's so much you can just take pictures of inside where, I don't know, maybe I'll get into macro photography. I have no idea. But uh, it's really kind of forced me to try this mic, do this vlogging, send it out there, let people know they're not alone, that uh, there's other people that are going to have to do the same thing I'm doing. Now, I, I'm taking a right on uh, Laurel Canyon, and there's a couple supermarkets up, up the ways. I believe I'm going to try a Ralph's, just because it's bigger. But... It's going to be packed. I guarantee it's going to be packed. And, uh, you know, hopefully it's not going to be that packed. 